Um, so, um, psychodrama is uh, an action method of psychotherapy founded by a Viennese psychiatrist and existential therapist called Jacob Moreno, who defined it as a, a scientific exploration of truth through dramatic method. Um, stemming from the words psyche meaning the soul or mind and uh, drama meaning action, um, it is uh, uh, the science of the mind that searches for the truth by uh, means of action methods. Um, he, Moreno uh, created psychodrama based on a philosophical system and that's what I'm going to focus on. Uh, but before that I'd like to uh, um, offer a brief introduction to the method, how it works. Um, it is an integrative psychotherapy that uh, engages participants holistically, paying attention to behavior, thoughts, emotion and body. So it involves uh, cognitive, physical and emotional movement of, of participants rather than sitting and talking as in uh, more conventional therapies. Um, the, the, the five uh, um, principal instruments of psychodrama are um, the psychodrama stage, where, uh, which is actually the physical space in which the drama is conducted. The protagonist, who is uh, the person, the, the group member, whose story or issue is presented through guided dramatic action. The auxiliary egos, like group members, who assume the roles of significant others in the drama. This could include significant people like um, um, a partner, a friend, a parent, um, or aspects of uh, the self or a person's internal world. For example, my optimistic self, my internal critique, um, my, my, my low self-esteem, etc. Also, um, um, a, a psychodrama session includes the audience, which is the group members that witness the drama, um, and the director or psychodrama therapist who facilitates the session. Um, so, as I said, Moreno was an existential therapist and uh, believed that uh, each individual is responsible for how they choose to act in a situation. Uh, he believed uh, that uh, responsibility can be elicited through the cultivation of spontaneity and creativity, which he saw as the cornerstones of healthy living. Um, we are all, in a sense, uh, our own creators, and spontaneity provides us with a readiness to respond as required. He had observed children playing in the gardens of Vienna and saw how through, um, taking, uh, th through the process of taking on roles and playing out scenes, they accessed their inner spontaneity as a resource, a resource for the creative resolution of conflict. He viewed this as uh, inherently therapeutic and wanted to provide the same experience for people with mental illness. So the psychodrama stage offered an entirely different dimension to psychotherapy in its provision of uh, a forum for people to explore their difficulties in uh, the context of time and space. In psychodrama, people are invited to step into a surplus reality space and reenact past or future situations as if they are happening in the present. This usually gives rise to uh, very powerful emotional responses and can surprise the unconscious into unlocking buried memories that may not be so readily accessed through talking alone. Um, so Moreno founded psychodrama, a here and now method, at a time where psychoanalysis and Freudian theory prevailed in the field of psychotherapy. So he had to uh, rethink existentialism in psychotherapy. Um, and uh, in his autobiography, he recalls an encounter with Freud in 1912, where he said to Freud, 
Dr. Freud, I start where you leave off. You analyze people's dreams. I give them the courage to dream again. Um, he recognized the interconnectedness of personal, social, and cosmic, di cosmic dimensions of life and urged us to act responsible in it, wishing every person to have a role in creating, co-creating actually, the structure of the universe. Um, he knew too that there is an inextricable link between society and mental illness and he regarded um, the following statement as one of his uh, best known quotes that a truly therapeutic uh, procedure cannot have less an objective than the whole of mankind. Um, it has been suggested that the characteristics of social illness can be seen in the mental illnesses of its people. For example, the early 20th century was dominated by neurosis and hysteria, reflective of the repressive <coughs> European culture at the time. Today, personality disorder is now the most prevalent psychiatric condition. And uh, there can be no doubt that uh, it involves some of the most vital social and cultural concerns, like the increasing breakdown of social and family networks, substance misuse, and child abuse, to name but a few. Uh, Moreno recognized the relational nature of humans and his uh, concept of encounter is at the center of the group process. He, he, he wrote a poem uh, that describes his definition of, uh, of encounter. A meeting of two, eye to eye, face to face. And when you are near, I will tear your eyes and place them instead of mine. And you will tear out my eyes and place them instead of yours. Then I will look at you with your eyes and you will look at me with mine. Um, so he saw the interaction between people um, as a crucial factor in the creation and development of spontaneity. And role reversal has been described as the engine of psychodrama that helps to keep what Martin Buber called the idol relationship alive. So when we reverse roles uh, in a psychodrama person with another person, we have an opportunity to see life through that person's eyes. We might see how we come across and how others perceive us. And uh, we gain a greater understanding of, uh, of the other person. Um, Moreno developed a philosophy that was not just about treating pathology but uh, also about helping people to grow through the development of a more flexible set of roles. A role is an interpersonal experience um, and needs usually two or more individuals to be actualized. Um, Moreno's emphasis on relationships in the human development of roles is uh, at the heart of contempor contemporary ideas about the, the importance of early interactions with caregivers in the development of the self and the subsequent impact on personality. And he suggested that the consequence of poor experiences in early life could lead to limited and flexible roles. Um, he argued that uh, emotionalism and uh, impulsive action are more in the realm of the pathology of spontaneity. This is related to the cultural concern, a term that he used to describe the end product of a spontaneous and creative process, such as a book or a film. He was concerned that too much attention on cultural concerns would take people away from the energy of the moment and stifle their spontaneity and creativity. And when people come to therapy, there is usually a problem with this guiding system. Um, the sequence of a situation, the context, that evokes a particular behavioral or role response and associated feelings are driven by a core belief system that has been sedimented within an individual and results in unhelpful situations. 
So in a psychodrama session, we, we, we identify um, the context, the behavior, feelings, belief system, and consequences of the role um, in the here and now and recent past. And then we track the belief system to explore um, the origin of a, of a, of a dysfunctional behavior. Um, it, 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 according to Moreno's philosophy, the past is only important in relation to its impact on the here and now. And uh, the protagonist revisits um, um, a present context at, uh, at, towards the end of the session in order to practice a new role and, uh, and uh, find uh, a new response to an old situation. Um, the idea that roles can be named, identified, changed or moderated is extremely helpful in therapy. Uh, people often see themselves as uh, being uh, stuck in a particular role without acknowledging that the role is context specific. And role analysis helps um, people to see this and reflect on the fact that they have choices about how um, they respond in a given situation. Um, and Moreno championed the value of the subjective uh, experience of a person. And uh, this could easily be seen to be part of the phenomenological tradition. The psychodrama stage is a place where, where a person can concretize their inner world. Um, and uh, and this, this is a subjective experience itself. Um, a question often asked is uh, why is action important in therapy? And the answer is that the body remembers what the mind forgets. The body holds all of our memories and emotions. It is our living journal. Within the cells, uh, organs, muscles and bones, um, the body is a life story. When we disconnect from our bodies, we lose access to ourselves in a very fundamental way. And when we reconnect to our bodies, we regain access to our um, essential and unique selves. Um, Moreno believed that uh, the self emerges from the roles a person plays and that the function of the role is to enter the unconscious and give it shape and definition. By using role play to work with um, issues, um, the therapist has a method that can reach into both the conscious and the unconscious mind of the client, meet them at the appropriate uh, developmental um, level, and allow the shape and definition of the roles that they have internalized to emerge onto the stage. I'm oh, sorry, but uh, what, the noise coming from the back is really hard to read, <clears throat> and right. we can't really see you either. So, is it possible maybe to either to stand up or to say to, just there's a lot of noise coming yes. from the back room? Okay, I'll try to. Really is there something <clears throat> here that's in the way of your vision? Well, okay, you're just finishing in a minute, so I can stand this. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Okay, so so by by using uh, role play to work with uh, issues, uh, the therapist has a method that uh, um, gives them. Oops, excuse me. Gives <laughs> has a method. Got lost now. Uh, sorry, that can reach into both the conscious and the conscious mind of the client, meet them at the appropriate developmental level, and allow the shape and definition of the roles that they have internalized to emerge onto the stage. So uh, clients have uh, um, um, the opportunity to view uh, a circumstance as it was, explore it psychodramatically and tease out the web of associated meaning they made of it at the time that they may still be um, living by. 
they can, they can integrate their split-off affect and develop new insights as their adult mind witnesses their child, adolescent or young adult world in its concrete form. Um, so um, psychodrama allows um, the effectively charged relational experiences to emerge and be worked with uh, experientially toward more satisfactory resolution and greater awareness. Um, Moreno also had to rethink the role of the therapist uh, in psychotherapy. He felt that a transparent ra rather than uh, the neutral approach should be adopted by therapists in order to foster the growth of the patient's perception uh, of the therapist as they really are. Um, and um, um, the curative factor of psychodrama is in the sharing of identifications and concerns between group members, um, serving to reveal uh, um, very deep uh, human connection and uh, promote group uh, cohesion. Um, so it is still the major contribution of psychodrama to have insisted that even verbal interchange should not be of um, the nature of uh, analysis and interpretation only, but more of the basis of uh, on the basis of encounter with group members sharing revelations about themselves rather than analyzing and interpreting only. Um, so psychodrama has been uh, predominantly a group method. Uh, but it is also used in uh, individual therapy as well. Um, it is um, a very powerful method where members um, have the opportunity to explore uh, personal beliefs, feelings and, uh, and um, difficulties and uh, allow themselves to be challenged by other group members and change their, own, their, their belief systems. Um, and Moreno's optimism about the healing potential of group is reflected in the following quote, give truth and receive truth, give love to the group and it will return love to you, give spontaneity and spontaneity will return. Um, so that was um, um, an introduction to um, the philosophical uh, system that psychodrama is based on. And um, I'm open to questions and thank you. Thank you very much, Eva.